So basically at ID Tech, we are inspiring this next generation of tech innovators and coders and encouraging them to take what they're passionate about and doing something further with it. We have this year over 50,000 students who will be attending one of our programs that's held at over 130 plus campuses nationwide. We are inspiring today's youth and finding the next generation of tech innovators, coders, game developers, engineers. So it's very exciting working with companies like SparkFun who share this passion and also are making a big difference in kids' lives starting very, very young. This week, I'm teaching Intro to Arduino IDE with SparkFun's Digital Sandbox. So far, this class has been fantastic. What I think is really cool about this course is that all the students will, no matter what, have to uh, go through programming. And so we highlight the basics of programming, but they get to do it in a really interesting medium. Really, this combination between software and hardware uh, really drew me to this class right here. One that I'm very proud of is our all-girls program. It's called Alexa Cafe, and we use the Arduino product in the Alexa Cafe program. One of them is the Arduino Lily Pad, where the girls learn how to make wearables that light up, you know, and do things. And so if a girl is interested in coding or is done coding, fabulous. But if it's somebody hasn't, then it's a good entry point too to excite them. The Alexa Cafe is mostly about girls need to be more into the electronics industry. This is the brain and you program it from a computer into this chip and it goes into here. It has yellow lights flashing and every time a light flashes, thunder or a buzz happens. When they finally see that project they've been working on and they've been struggling with it and struggling with it, then all of a sudden it clicks and they get that like aha moment. It's, it's the best part of my week. And then throughout the week, they apply all of the things that they've learned to actually build a project that solves a problem or works with a social movement. Right now what I have is this. It's this little LED thing, and it's an LCD screen. What I'm gonna add it to it is I'm gonna make, add it this. This is a magnetic sensor. What I'm gonna add is I'm gonna make it a little safe. What it's gonna say is type in the passcode. I have buttons to create a passcode. Here's a green one, it'll go green if you type in the passcode correctly. Once you type something correctly, then you'll be able to proceed. The other thing that's truly magical about this experience, the kids, don't realize a lot of times that they're learning. There's nothing better than that. 